What is up guys, welcome back to another player review. We are going to be looking at Inform Fernandez, whose shot has been increased by 5, which means we should definitely see a difference, shouldn't we? So, if you guys are looking for a cheap and reliable place to get you coins, check out battle.com. Their link will be in the description and use the code ETONY to get 5% off. If you guys are looking for cheap games, PSN cards or Microsoft points, check the link also in the description. So, Inform Fernandez, he goes for cheap. He's like 30k now. He's probably going to be around 15, 20k by next week. So, he anyone could buy him. Anyone at this point should be able to buy him. Now, in my opinion, he suits... Uh, a number of positions, sense attack and mid, striker even, and also sen central mid. So it really depends where you want to play him. This guy is tall and at the same time strong. Now look at his in-game stats. There's nothing to indicate this guy is going to be strong other than his balance. But he seems pretty strong. You'll see in the clips he gets past defenders. And also one of the really awesome things about him is you get to choose. Do you want to dribble past the defender? Do you want to skill past the defender? Or do you want to just force your way through onto goal with him? So you get a lot of options in your attack when you insert Fernandez in your team. And that's why I liked him as a centre attack in mid. But I also tried him out as a striker. And holy shit, he scores you loads of goals in that position as well. So it really depends on how you play and what you're playstyle sort of is when it comes down to a 5 star skiller with 4 star weak foot at the same time this guy it has just so many benefits with finesse shots you'll also see a really nice one right at the end and just long shot I think I scored the furthest away long shot with this guy his long shots are inc extremely powerful I actually found them better than Hunter Law and I have reviewed that guy and I don't even know how it even makes sense because this guy only has 79 shot power so it doesn't really make sense. Good agility and balance so a lot of benefits. Now the only problem I had with him is his positioning so with medium and medium work rates if you're going to play him up front as a centre attack in mid or a striker you will see him sit back quite a lot. If you're going to play him as a central mid you won't have any problems with his positioning. So it really comes down to what sort of position you will play him in. As a central mid, he is good there, but you're going to lose out on a lot of benefits like his shots, his skilling. I mean, you would really want this guy up front. So, positioning is bad when it comes down to center attack in mid, but I could pull up with it because of how much he brings to the table. So, I think I have my new favorite center attack in mid in the Serie A, and he's going to be replacing my inform Hamshik because I really enjoy using this guy, and he just he's just awesome. So... Um, another benefit is he's very cheap, so you won't have to, you know, wait for his price to go down, even though you can, because he's going to be at least 20k, I think. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I'd really appreciate a like. Make sure you let me know in the comment section below. What do you think of Inform Fernandez if you have tried him out? That 5 increase in shot is really noticeable. So, uh, let me know in the comment section below, and Fernandez gets a really nice 9.8 out of 10.